only a straight white man. Where are my pussy eaters at? A lot of pro-life billboards on the way from the Twin Cities, too. That's kind of funny. I wish they had an honest, real pro-life billboard, though. One that was like, did you know after 35 days in the womb, your fetus already has teeth, but their parents don't? <laughs> Such North Dakota when the host came up here and said he was no longer an alcoholic, almost no one clapped. <laughs> it's like, fuck you, bitch. <laughs> we know it's ruining our lives and we don't care. <laughs> I thought I'm from Minnesota. I thought I could drink, but I've lived in New York too long. It went away. I got we got so fucking drunk last night. Because yeah. <laughs> like the bar specials here are just out of this world. Like a bar special in New York is like, you get a dime off top shelf gin if you're bisexual or whatever. And then here it's like, every Bud Light's a buck till your dick stops working. <laughs> you drink double digits, you can have a go with my wife. But... Don't make her come though, she gets a little mouthy. Uh... In New York, you see a guy puke at a bar, you're like, that man has a drinking problem. In North Dakota, you see a guy puke at a bar, you're like, that's the mayor. <laughs> He's my ride. <laughs> Riley was kind of touching on this. This is a real North Dakota thing. You see a lot of like, you see a lot of like skinny Scandinavian women just like arm in arm with a bowling ball of camo. <laughs> It looks like he won her at the county fair. <laughs> it's like me really good at goblin talks. <laughs> there's not like a lot of mixed race dating here, but there's a lot of mixed numbers. A lot of sevens with twos, a lot of eights with threes. <laughs> you see some of these guys, you're like, his dick better be as big as his face is lumpy. <laughs> Considering dating, you want to get out there, you're kind of... It's nothing wrong with Last so. one was last fall. Yeah, over what it. happened? She decided uh, I got her job, and she said, oh, that's good enough for her. <laughs> <laughs> but is, you got her a job? Yeah. At what, the machine shop? Yeah. And then she broke up with you? Two weeks later. Yeah. I took her to a Bill Burr show. You took her to a Bill Burr show, and she was like, when he's like, we can hit women, she's like, I'm out. That's yeah. <laughs> I like football, but it's not, can we admit, football's not quite as fun as it used to be because of the concussions. It's a little, like, a little dicey when you know what happens to him. Like, whenever a running back gets fucking hit, I'm just like, ugh. He's gonna run for Georgia Senator. <laughs> Titan takes a head-to-head -head shot, you're like, ooh, that's a murder-suicide in 10 years. <laughs> oh, fuck, five years! <laughs> like Black History Month now, and I think like, and like Pride Month, I think those are good things, but can we admit corporations kind of ruined them? Because yeah. like Pride Month now is just like corporations, like just like having a contest to see who loves gay people more, you know? Yeah. Like Popeyes is like, all June, we're only slaughtering straight chickens, you know? <laughs> and then KFC's like, oh yeah, all June, gay people can fuck in the booths, you know? <laughs> and then Chick-fil-A's like, oh yeah, well all June, gay people eat free on Sunday. <laughs> Ice fishing, that, I was talking about that. Ice fishing has got to be one of my favorite things in the world because the funniest thing happens every year with ice fishing. A bunch of trucks fall through the lake. That's the funniest thing in the entire world, that it. Someone tries to get in one last ice fishing trip in late March and then their Chevy Silverado plummets to the bottom of Lake Waka Waka. And, and everyone's like, Randy died, no, Randy love. Listen to the mainstream media. <laughs> His final words were, if there's global warmer, then why am I dying of hypothermia? Only <laughs> that, snowflake. <laughs> Ice fishing is hilarious because, like, they could just wait. <laughs> Women 
when winter comes, women are like, yay, we can snuggle all winter. And the men are like, no, we're going to go huddle around a hole in silence. <laughs> and the women are like, that's what snuggling is. <laughs> Pussy! <laughs> <laughs>